Hello guys, it's a very brief tutorial how to use Decimator for Death Studio 4.9 and higher. And I have Windows 44-bit system and I have it already installed. It's the uh, first step what, uh, which uh, you should do after you purchase the plugin. It's around $50 cost. And then you should install it uh, via your installation manager. And then the next step, which is not obvious, uh, you should uh, uh, input the serial number into the Des uh, Studio Plugins folder and then only then this plugin start to work and uh, yeah, if you want to input the serial number you should go to help then uh, about installed plugins and then locate the uh, decimator entry uh, decimator does decimator in here and then it will be prompted you, for you to input the serial number, which you should copy from your account web page in your account page in Death Studio. Uh, okay, we make the does decimate uh, working, and to uh, to run it, you should uh, first uh, choose the model which you would like to decimate. We have this uh, beautiful uh, woman. Uh, it, it is Genesis uh, Model Three. And I want to decimate it uh, till the uh, size which is which fits for uh, uh, mobile application usage. And 30,000 uh, polygons is too much. It's around 4 megabytes if you say it in uh, export it to DAE, and around 1.6 megabyte if you export to FBX. So I would like to drop down the size to be applicable for usage in the mobile application. So to locate the decimator, you should go to panes and then the decimator will appear if you input the serial number and everything did correctly. So this decimator window is uh, quite easy uh, to use because it's only a few buttons in here. So we uh, selected our model and then we should push the prepare to decimate uh, some polygon map uh, generated and we can uh, start to decrease to drop down the resolution for example if i want to have it twice less size ex uh, when exported i'd like to drop the resolution twice or even more for example let's uh, input the 10,000 polygons and the face is uh, absolutely awful and the, the hands it's a real too low polygon for the uh, body. So maybe for some usage it's okay, but the face should be uh, fixed for some at some quality stage. And um, good thing is that decimator have this uh, weights tab. Here we can fix some uh, the spread, which uh, quality spread and you should input the figure between 0.01 till uh, 100. And the bigger is the better the quality. For example, if I want to have the face uh, to keep it more quality, then I input the 20 and then I just push the set weights and it's already recalculated. Okay, then I want the lips uh, to have some bigger quality. Just put okay, lips are okay, and then ears also like to be a little better. Okay, it's maybe too good. So, when you uh, make this uh, spread, uh, the total polygons map uh, recalculated. So, if you make ears uh, more detailed, it means that you take the, for example, 1000 uh, polygons from 10,000 just to draw the ears so the rest of the body will suffer from it so i recommend to keep as low polygons as possible uh, between these items it's a strange thing that uh, eyes almost a lot of entries related to eyes i don't know why why it's so uh, like irises eye moisture eye socket eyelashes it's clearer it's it's all related to eyes so i don't know why why so many interest for eyes but however i want to have arms uh, to have high quality for arms and uh, the breast 
also should be better because it's a woman, you know. Uh, so uh, let's keep uh, the face, um, body, 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 face, ears, torso. Let's have torso more with a more high quality. Okay, ears looks everything is okay. We don't care much about legs. And if we compare the uh, wire shaded, we can see how ma how many polygons. And here you can see also that it it has been triangled. And uh, if we set it back to thirty thousand, you can see the difference now. Yeah, right. So we can even input the 8,000 and depending on our application uh, it may look even quite okay even with 8,000 polygons against 34,000 polygons so we decreased it almost four times and it's kind of okay okay kind of okay so if you are interested uh, why this uh, beautiful woman is a uh, uh, rendered application for iPhone related to yoga and this poses is rendered to be used in there. So you can subscribe in here and that is the site. So I think it, this short tutorial was helpful to understand how to work with decimator. You can then create the load and to use it for other models maybe and uh, if you now make an export for some destination uh, it will show you the if we export today uh, it won't show but if you export to FBX, it will show you a quantity of vert vertexes. Ah, oh, verticals, right. It's still very high, but if you uh, reload the application, it will be updated. So this figure is uh, kind of confusing, but actually it works okay. So this decimator plugin is quite helpful if you know how to use it. You know, it's quite easy and handy. Thank you for watching.